Hello, everybody. This is a Lamley Showcase. I've got two old pros here to preview a bunch of <laughs> basics and premiums. Say hello to designer Mark Jones, the godfather himself. I feel old. <laughs> <laughs> you don't look old. And Jimmy Lou, the man of the hour. I have to reference this. There's uh, there's Jimmy's car. <laughs> He had a, we had a whole dinner celebrating him last night. He gave a great speech. Got some cool. Did I? He did a good job. I, I thought so. Yep. Yeah. I think he did. I thought he it was did a long. really, really cool car. Yeah. We, you always think it's long. Was yeah. it long, Mark? No, it yeah. didn't. Just thought it was well done. I didn't think thought so. Thought it was well done. <laughs> yeah. I feel old, too. Well, welcome to the, welcome <laughs> to the club. <laughs> so that's why I'm behind the camera. <laughs> so people don't know how old I am. Julian is in the side here. We love Julian. But because there's no packaging with what we're looking at, he feels left out. So, and we don't want to have. Can him you here. come photo bomb really quick though, sure. Mr. Julian? <laughs> like, so like, like, show that they're and, there. And he's got an old muscle shirt on though. And 50th anniversary, <laughs> baby. And Julian wants you to know, he's Jack. <laughs> uh, all right. So we got some cool stuff you guys brought with you. This yes. is, you know, we're filming this now. They're going to be shown at the convention. You will definitely see pictures online of these a lot of people will take them but we want to give uh you mark and jimmy a chance and julian um to uh, to give us a little bit of in-depth look into these uh into these upcoming premium and basic cars but jimmy let's talk i'll get it back up here let's talk basic to start you brought a few basic cars with you basics we did we did we have uh kind of like the little basic section here uh there's a lot going on with basics this year and so a lot of stuff that we can't really show yet so that's why what do you mean a lot of stuff going on with basics well, there's always a lot of stuff going on with basics. Fair enough. It's basics. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's always moving. Yeah. Yeah. But um, let me uh, kind of show you what we brought here. You're off camera with these basics. I'm going to move the camera down and move okay. them over here. And okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can, I can actually yeah. hold on to it. So first one up is the RX-8. And um, one of our designers, Charlie, he actually owns... Or maybe he sold it. Still owns it. Still owns it. He has an RX-8. Wow. Uh, so uh, he did this wonderful casting. I'll let you guess where you guys, where it appears. I think, you know, some people who are nerds of this franchise will know. Uh, but uh, yes, Understood. it's uh, yeah, it's the new RX-8. It looks pretty cool. It's uh, something we haven't had in the line. I know a lot of people have been asking for an RX-8. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're happy to actually have it in the line now. I, it, it seems like there's a gap there, and it's now being filled. Yeah, right? totally. Okay, totally. cool. Yeah. All right, we can we can breathe. So that's a new cast. Obviously, yeah. we're looking at at early stages of these casts. Yeah, seeing the finished product. Yeah, these so, are all EPs, so okay. don't worry about the colors, anything like that. What else are you handing me? Because I'm going to be the I'm going to be the uh, just really quick the new uh, Ford Lightning, the electric truck. Look at that thing. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's out of control. That's the epitome of Hot Wheels, right? Yes, yep, pretty much. <laughs> or lightning. Okay, yep. and it looks modified. That's there's yep. nothing stock about that. Thing. And and I believe right. Fraser did. Fraser did that. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Good. And he also did this one too, right? Correct. It's, as far as we know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we should make it known, Mark. You work on premium, Jimmy. Right. Your your premium and. Matchbox is that kind of what like... any of the adult collector stuff? Okay, yeah. and so so we don't have a basic designer here to kind of go deep into this. So it yeah. is a little bit of hey, look, this is coming yes. kind of thing, yeah. right? Correct. So totally. This is obviously a Camaro. I did a. This was sent to me to to do a sneak peek on, and I mean, there's a lot of details here that'll be really cool to see once yeah. this is finished. And you saw it before we did, probably. Oh, I'm very special. <laughs> probably. All right, now this is an interesting one. Yeah. This is fun. I gotta show this. So I, I what I'm curious about is if I show this for a second before you say what it is, and I could show the base. Uh, I guess maybe it's already been announced. People taking pictures of this already because you guys have shown this by the time we're showing this video. But I thought maybe this was a Ford Explorer, but it's not. <laughs> no. This is a Volvo. Volvo XC40 Recharge. So I believe it's the plug-in hybrid version, so I can yeah. get carpool stickers on it. Nice. Um, but yeah, it is all decked out. Um, you know, you got a couple snowboards up top. You got that bull bar up front with some LED uh, lights up there. Yeah. It's a uh, it's a pretty pretty little cool XC40. It'll be fun to see how this is finished, right? <laughs> yeah, it's, totally. It's deco. And it's cool to see like we've seen some classic Volvos. Now we're seeing some, some... modern Volvos hit the hit the line. That's yeah, nice. yeah. I mean. It, 
honestly, like you expect when you just hear XE40, you expect Matchbox, right? right. But this right. is the Hot Wheels yeah, version of Hot it. Wheel <laughs> yes, for sure. Yeah. Um, here's one. I think all the fans are. Uh, this is cool. Uh, excited for the Bugatti. Um, I believe Fraser did this one. He does most of the uh, new models for basics. Yeah. Uh, very cool, like shut offs up front and stuff. So, you know, it came out nice. Bugatti Bolide. Bolide. I think so, yeah. Yep. I gotta learn to say all these things. So, the more exotics you do, the more I have to really work on it. Work on your words. Yes. Really impressed by the number of shut offs there. That that took a lot of effort. Yeah. To get through our system. I can imagine. Very cool. And what are shut offs, Mark? Yeah, I'm sorry. Shutoffs are the holes in the body, and they call them a shutoff because it's uh, one part of the mold uh, hitting the other mold, and the material doesn't, obviously, that creates a hole. Right. So you have the, the male and the female mold hitting each other. and Got it. No material in between. So there's a new term we've lost, uh, we've learned. It's the shutoff. Yeah. Internal Mattel talk. Yeah, we call it a hole. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. <laughs> But that's cool. All right, yep. we'll learn another one, and then one other basic, right? Yes, and we're saving this one because I think this was very due uh, yes. with the fans. The uh, the first gen Viper RT10, right? Yeah, yeah. It says there, yep, RT10. Yeah, um, I know a lot of people have been asking, like, where are the Vipers? Yeah, and voila. There's some great Viper castings. I think the RT10's done been done before, but yeah. kind of more of a tuned kind of. And this is really nice. It's sleek. It's clean. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure Fraser did this one as well. Yeah, um, so, yeah. so built from the ground up, essentially. Yeah. It looks nice. Going to basic. Basic model. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. Yes. All right. Well, we've done. You guys did pretty good, considering uh, you know that's not your uh, <laughs> bread and butter here. We'll get these basics out of the way, but that's very exciting. I, you know, um, maybe when we're in California, we'll get Demon. Fraser to actually get on camera and do well, some. Well, actually, we stole Dima. Oh, that's right. He's come up to premium. Yeah. Huh? Yep. Right. So we'll yep. have to we'll have to mine out some new basic uh, folks. To, <laughs> yes, you will meet them soon. To, uh, yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. we'll we'll do that in California. And, and you know Fraser. Fraser. Yes. Fraser is amazing. Yes. Yeah. We have Craig with us now, uh, so he's awesome. The English mafia. <laughs> Now they, we know. They, they are yes. both British, yes. yes. <laughs> so expect a lot of green cars. And, you know, yeah. yeah, we'll be ready on the Union Jack on everything. And, yeah, we'll be ready. Um, and yeah, Dima. So we'll have to we'll have to pull Dima aside for in California and start talking about the premium stuff that he's working on. Totally. Okay, that'll totally. be fun. Mm -hmm. That'll be fun. All right, let's talk premium. I So you got what I'm seeing here. Let me tell you what I'm seeing. I've seen a lot of like... Of, EPs, FEP, whatever you, EPs, right? These are cars that are not, that are castings done, but uh, Deco's not, and there's still a lot of other development with them. Let, well, I'll let you guys walk through those, but I have a couple questions on a couple cars, and you can point out a few things, too, of the completed cars, and we'll talk, like, there's new casting here, we'll talk about that. Yep. But this, this was basic, it's moved to premium, this is the Mercedes. Yep. What line are we going to see that in? That's the 500E. Yep. Do you know what uh, makes yeah, it? Um, yeah. Go for it. Well, I'm just going to say the name of the line is Canyon Warriors. Okay. Yeah. So in car culture, and I believe that's Mix 3. Okay. Oh. So coming soon. Yeah, coming soon. Speed, Speed Machines is one. Speed Machines is one, yeah. and then the Italian mix that I cannot pronounce. Spettacolore. <laughs> I don't know Going if that's true. back up. Say it again. Spettacolore. All right. We'll, we'll be ready for that's it. That's probably wrong. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably. <laughs> uh, and that's in that mix. And obviously, if we see one version and then we see a black version, we're clearly looking at the chase. Exactly. Correct. That is awesome. And I mean, the fact that it's the black versus the 500E, e, Mercedes has to be in black, and you've got, you're have got you going to make us chase the chase for this one to get the black version. So Sorry, that's guys. really, really cool. <laughs> oh, no. no I, I, I've said I like it, and I'm not going to not gonna uh, move away from that. In the back here, too, I just go ahead. You're going to say it. Kind of, yeah, kind of jumping around, but the yeah. same mix. The uh, Canyon Warriors. Canyon Warriors, okay. correct. And this, yeah. we finally see the, uh, not finally, but we see the M5 in a stock deco. As opposed to the racing deco that we saw in the Correct. in the diorama set, exactly. Right? Correct. Yeah. So Correct. I'm excited to see that one. That's uh, that is clean. Yeah. And Phil did that one. Correct. Right? That casting. Yes. So that's nice to see that. Say one. hi, Phil. 
Hello. Hey, <laughs> I, I have no idea the sequence of the videos. We filmed the Phil video either. It's coming before or after this, but uh, yeah, he's there. He's there. <laughs> nice job, Phil, on the on the BMW. Um, and, and yeah, I mean, I I mean, I could talk. We could talk hours on all of these, but point out with at least the castes that are done. We'll talk about the Lamborghini in a second. What are we seeing? Where are these coming from? The mixes that we're going to see them in. Oh, see? Her, I wasn't even pointing that. There we go. So we're talking about these two cars. Yes. And that's another uh, Car Culture Race Day series. And oh, I don't so know bring what... it back Race Day. Yes. Correct. Okay. Yes. I don't know what n number mix it is. It's the fourth mix. It fourth should be after uh, Canyon Warriors. Okay. Are we looking at the chase here? Or are we? I think you are. Okay. Sure. So that's been. So we're going to see a regular version of this one, and obviously it's also been converted from basic. That's correct. Now yes. it's gone to premium, and that's so we're looking at a chase, and we and, see the. And and actually, this is um, one of the 75th anniversary right. cars for Porsche. That we're doing, sorry. Yeah. Um, and so the regular version actually looks nothing like this. Really? Yeah. So it's completely yeah. different. It's one with one of our awesome partners, and you you guys will see it eventually. Oh, I just cool. didn't have one to show, oh, nice. so we brought See, that's this a one nice out. Little first. Tease. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Cool. I'm excited yeah. about that. I'll have to see what the what the difference yeah. is. Obviously, between the chase, there's their RA. Even right the there. tease videos have teases. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got to keep them coming back, right? That's right. Um, HKS Skyline. Oh right? yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. So you know the we've done the R32 before, yes. and that was the uh, what the 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 Group A Group One uh, car Godzilla. Yeah. This one is actually a um, drag. Really? The, yeah, the real R33. Um, obviously, like, this specific version isn't it, so... The casting's it's, not right, but... It's uh, inspirational, like, you know, the spoiler and stuff's different for sure. for the drag version. But, you know, uh, you know I love camo. Yeah. And uh, if there's any automotive camo, it's HK's camo. <laughs> so... There we go. There we go. So, there's yeah. Camo car. Happy to see that one come out. Um, that one is in our two packs that we do. Okay, so we're going to see that with, uh, you can tell us what it's matched up with? Uh, no, because okay. I forgot. All right. <laughs> Actually, Why I didn't forget. That's a secret. <laughs> yeah. um, Golf Mustang, this thing looks fantastic. That's the casting from Need for Speed from years ago. Yeah, yeah. And we haven't done that in a while, right. so we thought it was good. And then, you know, obviously Golf livery. Yeah. Who doesn't love a Golf livery? Um, that will be paired with another Mustang uh, in two packs. Nice. So we're seeing that. So both of these are two packs right here. Is yep, yep, at. yep, yep, yep. And then um, I think, yeah, the Lamborghini, right? right? That's the other finish. Oh, the Impala in the back too. So those are the two that I'm seeing that are that are finished. You can talk about either one if you want. Half finished. Half finished. Yeah. <laughs> yeah well, let's start there. Let's start there. <laughs> the Impala is going to come with the uh, Chevy Silverado, and uh, kind of a American drag. Sorry, American stock car theme in the, in a team transports. It's nice to see, like you know, I, you know this, these are kind of you know throwbacks to you know, vintage racing and things. Mm -hmm. It seems like you're you know you're right. you're pulling this, you're expanding on that. This was in 3D print form, I think, last time, right, six months ago. So it's still moving along, right? And we're yep. going to see these two together. Yeah. Yes. With skull wheels. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> we, we know you're right. concerned about that. So we just wonder. <laughs> Confirm that for you. Well, it looks awesome, and I'm again. I'm, I assume these will kind of match and match in some way, right? So uh, excited to see that pair uh, come together. And then, I, yeah, I think of, of everything that's done. The other one is the Lamborghini. Yes. And, well, and I and I see two of them. So you I do. Know so what that you know what that means. Yep. Uh, this is the new Countach. Uh, there's a bunch of numbers that go with that, but. Uh, yeah. LP I or one? 800, I think. 800-4. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what makes is this in? The one I can't pronounce. Oh, so this is this is, this is coming up. <laughs> yeah. So this will be in the next mix with and that and we are looking at the chase as well in, in black. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Yep. yep. Oh, that is awesome. What else is in that name? I don't know. We, we, we need to move on, right? Don't, yeah. We'll know Don't ask hard questions. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Probably um, they're Italian cars, though. That would make yeah. sense. Thank you. Thank you for that very, very uh, I, I insightful will say, message. I will say the packaging, and Julian is here, the packaging is super cool. you got to line them all up when you get them. Ah. 
Nice job, Julian. <laughs> <That's the glory. laughs> Eva. I, I hope people heard that. Um, all right. Well, I I'm gonna kind of sit back because I see there's some really interesting stuff here from this angle. I don't know if all the details can be made out, so I'll let you guys kind of maybe move from one side to the other and talk about these castings. Then we'll call it a day. These new castings that are coming out. Okay. Sounds good. These are the cars Jimmy made me do. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> First off, do you want me to lift them up, John? Yeah, and then okay. I can. I, I've okay. got the turntable shot, so we'll okay. you know see people will see those as well. But first off is your uh, four door Integra. Integra, and we're not telling you where it's going to show up at, but if you're a fan of the brand, you'll probably know. Got it. <laughs> got it. I think you just kind of told us, but uh, well, it's cool because we're seeing the you know we've seen a lot of Integras, but mm -hmm. we have the RLC coming. Yes, Brent yes, talked yes, about yes, that yes, one yeah, and then this one. Yeah. So, and obviously all, all of these that we're going to go to now, no deco on these. So yep. don't judge the wheels. Don't judge the color. Anything exactly. like that. These are exactly. just the castings themselves, right? Yeah. That one will be blue though. Okay. Hint, hint. All right. There you go. <laughs> yep. That looks really, really cool. And I, I mean, any details you want to share? Then you go to the next one. You guys sure. can Okay. Next one, uh, this is a Fiat 131 at Barth. And uh, I'm excited to do this because it's another rally car car that kind of fits into our uh, kind of group B rally yeah. uh, stuff that we've been doing. The, this, is, uh, this is totally you. Oh. <laughs> right? I mean, that's, that's a Mark Jones car right there. That's how I think of it. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, one interesting thing that there is, uh, is the separate uh, fender flares, which is a little unusual for us, but we thought it it worked good because of the color break, so we can do uh, fenders that are a different color. That will be really, really cool. What, do, you, do you want to share where we're going to see this one, or do you remember? Don't ask hard questions. I'm going to keep asking the it, tough questions. It is in premium. Okay, thank you. <laughs> well, you guys are really giving us good stuff. <laughs> premium you know, the car thing culture. Is, is that we want to see the cars, right? Don't come. Don't we don't come. know that other stuff. Don't come. All right. Next one is a K5 Blazer car that we probably long overdue um, this is great <laughs> you might recognize some things about that particular version but uh, we're just glad that we got to do it yeah yeah and we're gonna play that game where we don't tell you where it came from okay <laughs> like so they people have to guess exactly now this piece so, there's like a separate piece there like this there is, is that yes it's a roll bar okay I, well, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to lead to questions. I like, I think there's it has a couple of lights on it. It's what I'm saying. Lights, like, on there's yeah. Like yeah. lights on that roll bar. Because whenever you flip upside down, you need to have your lights on. So you yeah, can... so they can find you. Yeah. <laughs> right. This is we're going off the rails real quick, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we should probably go and take a swim. <laughs> only, if you're, only if you're daring. <laughs> All right, what's next? Uh, another BMW M5. Okay, this so is this a, is cool. Yeah. We already ha we have the other M5, right? That filled it. Can, yeah. Can I hold these up together? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So there are differences. Yeah. Which one? E34 and an E39. So nine and the years wise. So this is the 2001, and this one is 90, the 1991. 91, yeah, older yeah. version. You can tell us where it is, Jimmy. Nope. Fair enough. But it looks cool. It looks really cool. Can you tell us what color it is? Well, that's mm. silver there, John. I... <laughs> we will pause for a second while I, <laughs> while I, while I yell at the talent because they're, uh, they're being very difficult right now. No yeah. Kidding. It's whatever color you wish it to be. Okay, fine. I'm going to keep asking. I, you, okay. you can give me whatever answer you want. <laughs> but I love the fact that we're seeing, I, again, like the expansion of, of some of these awesome Euro cars, and it's cool to have different generations of these cars that we that we did. I, I mean, the M5 was one of my favorites from last year, and now to see another one coming, yeah. is, they're going to look really cool together. Okay, but I have to say, now I am going to indulge for a second. You know, there's certain cars that I have wanted to see so badly. Prelude was one when when Rhea did that one. This one. <laughs> This one was, and everyone says, oh, Lamley. Everything is Lamley's favorite. I get it. But there are certain cars, like at certain times, we all evolve, right? There's different cars we like at different times. Yep. And when this Lexus hit, I was 
in love. And I still am. I still think this is one of the coolest cars. So talk about this one. Well, this particular one's called the Toyota. I'll tell you. I just flipped it up and saw it. And so I'll just shut my mouth again and put it all back. But same car, same car. Same car. Same car. Right? Yeah. Different side. Yeah. Just a steering wheel on a different side. Yep. You notice our new graphics. We have ES on everything. That's a new graphic <laughs> yeah. thing we're going to be doing. Hope you guys, you guys like it. Yeah. Uh, ES stands for El Segundo. Which means that's where it needs to be, and you know where it's supposed to be. And exactly. So, yeah, I get it. Yep. I get it. So if this ever made its way to where it's not supposed to be, you will know where it came from, right? Mm-hmm. I get it. Anything you want to mention about this one? Is there a particular reason you wanted to do it? or? Well, Leeway has one. Right. And uh, designer, yes, Leeway, our graphics designer, yep. uh, you know, works on basics, five packs, uh, NFTs. Mm-hmm. Uh, so he has one. It's actually really funny because uh, what's his bumper sticker on the back? <laughs> Prius bait or something. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just making fun of the Prius, and he uh, shows it to me all the time. Yeah, I bet. I bet. <laughs> as well as she. So hopefully, Van can incorporate that on this one. Too. <laughs> and should I ask where we're we gonna see this one or? In what kind of uh, deco or anything? No, but it'll be in car culture. Okay. <laughs> I mean, that's an answer, right? It's not, it's not other lines. It'll yeah. be in car culture. Okay. Now, I see a very familiar car here. You do? Yeah. You, must, mean, yeah, you must be from Germany? I, it seems like a car that probably should have been done yesterday. but Yeah, we probably should have done it a while ago. Yeah, it's the 320 uh, Group 5 BMW. Yeah. And uh, had a lot of fun doing that. I actually got a couple of sh- shutoffs that I was really proud of until I saw Fraser's uh, Bugatti here. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking for him. I must oh, be getting, I see him. Yeah, I must be getting uh, soft in my old age. But uh, glad oh, to do that yeah. car, and uh, I think it's kind of iconic. And the livery that we're, we have planned for it is very iconic. Yeah. yeah. I mean, this, I believe, is in two packs. Oh. Or am I wrong? He, you... You're probably right. Yeah, I think it is. There, we got something in <laughs> I'm not sure it's good, but... Yeah. I don't know. That's good information. Well, let's call a lifeline. Julian! No idea. I haven't started working on that one. <laughs> All right. We got a ways. It'll be a while before we see that one. Cannot wait. I'm All just right. going to say it's in premium. Fair enough. You're giving really good answers, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm excited about this car, and I, yeah. I am going to ask... Again, the, this has been unveiled at this point, so people know what it is. But this was a double take, looking at this thing. Um, and, well, you guys can, I'll hold it up. You guys can tell us what this is. Well, I'll let Jimmy talk, but I'm just thinking he's probably reliving his childhood. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> talk about this. Yeah, uh, Honda Accord. Uh, I mean, it's the uh, JTCC version, the Japanese Touring Car one. Yeah. Uh, you know, it had that famous uh, Jax, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but that Jax livery on it, and there's also a Castrol version, but uh, it's just one of the coolest cars ever. Um, you can see uh, Mark did the single exhaust, uh, single center exhaust Look at the at end that. there, yeah. Uh, and yeah, I'm excited for this one to come out. And don't ask me where. Premium? <laughs> Premium, you got yes. that. Yeah. So I, so that, and that's like, Again, I've been racking my brain as you mentioned the car. So this is just something that I think you guys wanted to do. Yeah. 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 It's not filling any sort of... Yeah. <laughs> and and I will mention the, the wheels are inboard there, just like the real race car. Okay. Yeah. That's really cool. You know, is this the first Accord? Considering... Oh. Phil, you know? My... Him? I would say probably. Yeah. I think it's it is. Yeah. I'm surprised too, yeah. That might have come, right? Yeah. But I, yeah. like, that's, when you think about it, have you never done a Camry? I mean, it really is, the, that's the, that's the yeah, next question. I don't question. think we've done a Camry. No. And if you're going to do an Accord, you do it. And I still ask for my father's 82 Accord, but I mean, it is as square and as boring as it gets, <laughs> but I still love that car. But it's nice to see an Accord here mm-hmm. in any shape and form. And this one's fascinating. I think it's going to be really exciting. All right, one more. One more. Two more. Oh, that's two right. More, yeah, yeah. That guy. That's two. right, yeah. yeah. Here we have the um, Toyota Land Cruiser Prada, or you might know it as something else. It starts <laughs> like, with an L. Yes. <laughs> yeah. But uh, we ha- we wanted to mo- modify it, so that's why it's a Toyota. Got it. And uh, I worked with a really talented sculptor on this one, and I think it came out really neat. We got to do uh, uh, re- revised bumpers and the and the, also the revised front and rear bumpers. 
with a toolbox and a spare and the bowl bar. Is that what it is? I learned a new term tonight. <laughs> like shutoffs. <laughs> and well, no. It'd be nice if we had shutoffs. Yeah, right. Yeah. Term's nice. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be nice if we had shutoffs on the roof rack, but <laughs> oh, I see. we don't have them there. No, but it still looks awesome. Yeah, I think it'll be a good one. Yeah. 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 Uh, one note, those are not the wheels. Right. It's coming with. I uh, figure. Yeah. <laughs> well, they're all. I mean, all of them have plastic wheels on them, right? But they're all yeah. going to get premium. Yeah, yeah. It'll have right. the the our newer off road, oh. similar to the one. Oh, so uh, that will give us okay. Yep. Now, yep. now we get an I guess that's that's. And then we have one other truck, right? Okay. Yes, you've Straight almost forward. made it. <laughs> but uh, this is a uh, one of the new team transports for the coming year. Now, I'm trying to remember. Did we have? We might have had this. I, I think we had a 3D a print off. Yeah. Yeah. And, oh, okay. But it's nice. It's nice to have, especially with this moving part. It's nice to to see it completed at this point. It's kind of the first one we've done with a separate cab, right? Um, so that's one thing. And then the sides flip up so you can see the cars. Try that. There you go. And it can fly too. But... <laughs> and so the so, car will sit in there, and you can kind of nestle in there with the with yeah, those notches in there. So and you can actually see it. So that yeah. is going to be cool. Now, when it's packaged. Will this be packaged open so you can see the car in it, or will the car be kind of light? Julian, yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't, <laughs> I don't think the blister. Yeah, it sounds like a problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. He said it sounds like a problem. I mean, ultimately, uh, if we if we shut one side, yeah, it still looks it's too still wide for a blister. Wide, right? yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it'll so probably be coming out, come out like the other or or on top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that will be really cool. Obviously. I think we can safely say that will be in Team Transport. Yes. 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 With whatever car, I don't know. A or very cool know. car. Okay. If it starts with the L and ends with the Iberty Walk. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> um, that, okay, that will be very, very exciting. Friends, we did it again. Cheers. Now you get six months off and we're going to do it again in LA. Uh, so... Figure out what models you want to show. This is awesome. This is very exciting. You you showed us some really cool castings. You gave us no other good knowledge whatsoever at all <laughs> where they're going to be. But that doesn't matter. They'll hit the pegs eventually, right? And uh, and uh, we can uh, we can look forward to that. I'm really excited about uh, some of these to come up. And as you guys know, I love car culture, and you two uh, have a big are a big part of that. So it's exciting to see what's coming. So I appreciate you guys sitting down with us and and. Uh, showcasing these and yeah you guys got six months to prepare for the next one so. <laughs> always a pleasure john yep thanks guys and julian and phil thanks again all right you're welcome <laughs> thanks everybody thank you bye